afternoon from Preston New Road. I've uh, been at the hub this morning and had a coach load today come from Lancaster. Lovely people. Um, I think it looks like it was organised by Sarah, one of our women from Wednesdays, and some of her friends organised a coach to come today as well. Um, everything okay? Are you happy to speak on live stream? Oh, thank you. I didn't, really, I, I mean, didn't really know very much about it. Because I understand there's been three arrests already today. Yeah, they'll give you more details. Okay, love, there, no worries. Yeah. Thank you for your help. Um, so, yeah, so it sounds like it's been the most appalling of days. Uh, I was on cleanup duty in the kitchen this morning. So, um, apparently, according to the woes have come down, there have been three arrests. Apparently, it's kind of a zero tolerance policing today. It's completely different atmosphere and framework. So, um, I knew before we set off already that there was one police arrest and that was for a gentleman for sitting where I always sit actually, over by the entrance. There were no vehicles coming in or out, but they told him if he didn't move he'd be arrested and he didn't move and he was arrested. Even though he wasn't obstructing because there was nothing to obstruct. Just walked past another gentleman who's let me know that Gazer and another man, I don't know who, I'm sorry, uh, were just arrested. I asked why and they said because the other man they said was obstructing and Gaze was doing the filming. So again, oh, look at that. Look at that. That was lovely. Tourists coming into Blackpool lending support. You'll see that the police are there. Now, I'm gonna try something, and I don't know how it's gonna go, but. I always walk up this side of the road and I see no reason why I can't. So I'm now going to try it and see what happens. So you can see the police now are at centre road. In a moment they're going to react to me. Now I don't want to be arrested, so I'm not going to push my luck. So I'm going to see how it goes as I've just got here. And I'm going to see what they say to me, mainly because I want to know what the wording is. Why did they stop you? the side of the road for Can us. I ask why? Because we're asking you to do so. Can I okay? ask the reason because first? At moment in time, the police in operation, for your own safety, you go across the other side of the can road. Can I ask please. what you mean for my own safety? What am I doing well, that's harmful here? Because, I've been here since road. January the 5th. Right. And so I right. always go on this side of the road. Please, please, please over there. No, can you, I'm standing on a curb. I am, why are you stopping that man from moving? How, how is that dangerous? If you're on safety, please. Don't touch me. Don't touch. So Don't touch! Thanks very much. Yeah. I'm now on a traffic island. Is this a crime? Is it a crime to be on a traffic island? What police force are you? What police? And you're? I'm asking questions. Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Don't touch me! Well done! Right, get out of the carriage way. Get the your own safety. And now there's nothing coming, it's still in the truck. Why? When have you ever done that? When have you decided it was okay for you to stand there and stop us on that side? Right, so let me sum this up. I'm on this side of the road, but I'm further down. So at the moment, they haven't come back for me. Walking up on this side of the road, but down before the gates. They're gonna stop you, grab you, handle you in ways you shouldn't be handled, and shove you across the road. If you don't go across the road, they will make it your fault that people will be penalized and unable to journey. Because as you saw, they blockaded a car in order to get me off a perfectly safe curb. I was up on the curb, I was no danger, cars were no danger to me. And yet they stopped the traffic, they not do anything. How dare they stop me and why can't I, as I've done since January, go and sit here and not one has given me a reason. I want a senior officer.
Can I speak to the senior officer, please? Can you point out the senior officer? That's not me. I know it's not you. I'd like to speak to the senior officer. Right, you should have to stand by a minute. Whoa, 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 whoa. I'm... This is what you're doing. You're going to get yourself killed. Let go of me. I am going to look before I step. What? You stepped Don't make you a presumption. I took a step that way. You took a step forward. Please do not tell me I made it to That's 55 you without you touching my arms well, to keep I've me safe. I want to speak to a senior officer. Standing That's the, the end of our discussion. Of end of our discussion. Hey. Yeah, lots. End of our discussion. Can I speak to a senior officer? Make sure that you're safe. Really, it isn't. Yes, it's it your is. responsibility to get the trucks in. Go and find me a senior Mother's officer. I, what I'm asking stop, is for. Stop, can I have a senior, a senior officer, officer, please? No. No. Who you need to speak to? We're upset now. Upset? Well, I'll explain to you if you want to come across the other side. I'm of the fucking road. sick as can be. Uh, I have blisters in my mouth. I can barely breathe. Keenan. And all. Find me a senior officer there and I'll come over. Oof. Bear with me, I'm a bit emotional today. Some of us have been feeling ill. Whew. This policing is absurd. Look. What gives them the right to do that? You know, when you've done nothing wrong. Um, I'm going to stop filming for a little while and I'll come back in a bit.